This looks so cute! Matthew will love it! Oh… Maybe not. I'll need to fix it. Great. I don't have an eraser. It's fine. There'll be one in my pencil case. Where is it? I know I have one. Hold on. Gina! Can I use your eraser, please? Sure. Here you go. Oops. Hey, you. Thanks. I appreciate it. Just what I need. Matthew still has it! I'll go see him. He'll be so surprised. Phew. Matthew lives far away. At least I don't need a shower later. I should've brought a jacket. I can't wait to see him. What? You look so pretty today. I don't believe it! And with my eraser! This is the worst! Stupid Matthew! How could he? I'm never gonna give him my eraser again! <gasps> what am I gonna do? Gina! Uh, how long have you been there? Use the sharpener. How? Wait a minute. I've got it! Thanks! I should have thought of this earlier. I'll start by flipping the sharpener over. Then I'll cover the underside of the sharpener with glue. I'll fill it all the way to the top. Now to let it set. That should do it. The glue will erase the pencil. It's working perfectly! Now to finish my drawing. Huh? I thought I could help. And I got you this. Oh, it's so cute! I'm sorry. Alright, let's go! Oh wait, after you, of course. Wait, we'll go together. Time to see what the wheel is gonna pick! Ooh, a smiley emoji! Uh, really? Yes! I get to use one hand, and you get to use zero! Ha! Now let's see what the magic gets us. Wait, squeeze bottles? You know what, Skye? Let's get some aprons for this challenge. Okay, now we're ready to do this one! Maybe I can make the wheel change to something else. Come on, come on, come on! Please! Oh my gosh! It totally worked! I can't believe it! And now I get to do an ice cream instead. Okay, that circle works. And now I better start with some eyes. He needs some eyebrows too, I think. Okay, that should be enough for this one. On to blue! I'll draw these tears and then fill them in with the blue. <sighs> this is working okay, I think. There goes all the batter. It's starting to work. Now under the red. Just gotta give it a squeeze. Just gotta get it along the blue like this. Not bad, all things considered. Alright, on to the yellow. Can't have a smiley without yellow. I've just gotta fill in all the space with this color now. Gotta make sure each little area has color in it. Just a little bit more. And there! Time to flip it! Oh my gosh! Look at how good this is turning out! Oh no. I got a tickle in my nose. This is bad. A cow! Oh no! The lip came right off! Oh! It made a huge crash! Oh. Yeah, that's a rough turn, Sky. Sorry. Whatever. It's fine. I guess I'm done now. Well, here. Maybe I can use the spatula to help you out a bit. I'll just push it a little over here. It's not like I can get any worse, I guess. There, see? That's better, right? Yeah, it is! <sighs> Thanks, I guess. Yeesh, she's so grumpy right now. But hey, take a look at how mine turned out. Isn't it cute? Okay, I'll press the button this time. I wonder what it's going to land on this time. Ooh, a tree! I didn't expect that at all! Wait, I got no hands again? Let's see what the magic gives us for this challenge. Oh, I guess we've got a bottle of ink and a… straw? Well, guess I should get started. Time for you to show off your stuff, elbows! Great job! Now let's open the bottle of ink. Yes! Okay, good thing straws are actually made for the mouth. Alright, now I need to use this to get some ink, I guess. <gasps> it's working! What the heck am I supposed to do with this straw? Oh no! She's drinking it! Stop! That's ink, not soda! Uh, what? Oh, phew, I thought you were 
drinking it. I'm trying the only way I can. Just gotta keep blowing this ink in the direction I wanted to go. Wow! That's turning out amazing! I can't believe you can do all of that with a straw in your mouth! Ugh! Why isn't this working? Maybe I just have to blow even harder into the straw. Come on! Come on, you dumb ink! Phew! Wait, what's on my face? Aw, I got splattered with ink! What's she crying about over there? Ugh, she's a total mess. Wait! Huh? Stop! Why? Look! I've got this pink paint! I'll just squeeze a line of this paint out. And now for another color, too. Okay, I've got my paint lines. Now I need a cotton swab. I'll dab it in this light pink color. Now watch! I'll just dab it again, but on your black inky branches. See? It looks like flowers! Like little buds that have opened in the spring! Look at how great this is turning out! Isn't it beautiful? Wow! You really helped make my tree even more special! I'm so glad we worked on this together! Me too! It's lovely! Okay, I'll press the button this time. I wonder what it's going to land on this time! Ooh! A tree! I didn't expect that at all! Wait, I got no hands again? Let's see what the magic gives us for this challenge. Oh, I guess we've got a bottle of ink and a… straw? Well, guess I should get started. Time for you to show off your stuff, elbows! Great job! Now let's open the bottle of ink. Yes! Okay, good thing straws are actually made for the mouth. Alright, now I need to use this to get some ink, I guess. <gasps> it's working! What the heck am I supposed to do with this straw? Oh no! She's drinking it! Stop! That's ink, not soda! Uh, what? Oh, phew! I thought you were drinking it! I'm trying the only way I can. Just gotta keep blowing this ink in the direction I wanted to go. Wow! That's turning out amazing! I can't believe you can do all of that with a straw in your mouth. Why isn't this working? Maybe I just have to blow even harder into the straw. Come on! Come on, you dumb ink! Phew! Wait, what's on my face? Aw, I got splattered with ink! What's she crying about over there? Ugh, she's a total mess. Wait! Huh? Stop! Why? Look! I've got this pink paint! I'll just squeeze a line of this paint out. And now for another color, too. Okay, I've got my paint lines. Now I need a cotton swab. I'll dab it in this light pink color. Now watch! I'll just dab it again, but on your black inky branches. See? It looks like flowers! Like little buds that have opened in the spring! Look at how great this is turning out! Isn't it beautiful? Wow! You really helped make my tree even more special! I'm so glad we worked on this together! Me too! It's lovely! Okay, are you ready, Ashley? Can I go first, please? Sure, go for it. Thanks! This is so exciting! It's the bunny! See? Are you serious? It's the cat! No! No way! It's the bunny! Stop it! You're mean! I'm only following the rules. If you want to play that way, bring it on. Let's do this. I've been training for this my whole life. Come at me. Ugh, my nose! Oh, I need to do something! That's it! I, I give up! Oh, give me that! Watch this! I'll draw some S shapes on the paper, then join them up. This is gonna be so cute! Can't forget two smiling faces! It's a bunny and a cat! But they need some color. They look so happy! It's so easy to draw this! I'm almost finished! Justin, look at this! They're hugging! Whoa! It's a cat! It's amazing! Aw, it's so adorable! Take that! Wait, what's that? Oh! 
you look so cuddly! There's a tiny draft, too! This one's mine! Aww! Okay, I guess this little guy's mine. Heh, <laughs> my draft is much better. Okay, don't move. I need to draw you. So far, so good. What are you doing? I'm examining the draft. Oh, good idea. Hmm. I wonder how Justin's doing. Pretty realistic, isn't it? I'm gonna call him Jerry. It doesn't look like a draft. This is gonna be tricky. It's all about getting the right scale. Hang on! I have an idea! I'll place my hand like this and then draw around it. I'll add a face. And now it's a draft! Let's color it in! This brown is the perfect color. And I can color the rest yellow. Careful! I don't want to make any mistakes now. Now for the neck. That's it! I'm glad I thought of that! Yeah, okay, that's pretty good. Oh, I'm sorry, Jerry. You can have this! Thank you! Okay, the next round! Wait, cover your eyes! Ooh, mysterious! Hehe, <laughs> I'm gonna surprise Ashley. Ugh, that's pretty gross. Ooh, and it smells awful! What's that smell? Sorry. Wait, Justin! I know what we can do! Check this out! I'll start by drawing a tree. Then some apples. Let's add some green leaves. I better stay in the lines. It's looking good! I'll add some dark green for the leaves. It just gives it texture. And of course, the trunk has to be brown. Using vertical pen strokes makes it look like wood. Then we'll color the apples red. They look so juicy! Ta-da! It's an apple tree! It's good, but it's not a real apple. <gasps> Justin, look! Whoa! That's so cool! Mmm, that's so tasty! Try one! I think I will! Think you could draw pizza? One, two, go! Oh, close! I'll solve this with a spin of the wheel! Who was that? Oh, that was so weird. Oh, look at the wheel! What? Oh, wow! This might be tricky. Mmm, stop! What? Let's make it interesting. One, two, three, go! This is tense! Oh no! My pencil! It's okay, I have another! This isn't going well! Oh, come on! Huh? Oh, unlucky. I don't have time for this! <sighs> this is taking too long! Uh, I need to hurry! Time's almost up! Ugh, get out of here! Hey, keep your garbage away from my art! Although, this might be useful. I'll start by drawing a ballerina. This'll look great! She looks so graceful. And I'll use the pencil shavings as the tutu. I'm really happy with this. Hey, Ashley. What do you think? Mm, I wasted so much time! But I can still finish my drawing! Just give me a moment! Ugh, careful! Okay, that's it! What do you think? It's good, isn't it? Great job! Look at the timer! We did it! Put it there. Well done. Wow, that's really stuck up there. That looks chewy. Uh-oh! Hi. Take a seat, Ellie. Oh, okay. Don't look at me. She seems friendly. This color suits me. 
Uh, achoo! Okay, class, open up your books. Do I have to? We have a very exciting lesson today. Yeah, right. I love her notebooks! I suppose I better take some notes. I know, my pen is super cute. I wish I had nice things! All my things are so boring! <laughs> it's not fair! What's going on back there? Hold on. What's the problem? I have pen envy. Let me see that. That's one fancy pen. Maybe I can help. Really? Upgrade your pens with a simple trick. Remove the parts from the pen. Then fill the casing with glue. Try not to make a mess at this stage. That should do it. Now pour in some glitter. Put the ink back into the casing. And screw on the nib. No more boring pens. Looks good, huh? Wow! Look at that! I can't forget about this cute little guy. Oh, he's so adorable. Thanks! Hmm. Wait there. Now I feel more comfortable. Wow! You're so stylish! I'll take those. These won't do. You need a makeover. I feel so alive! How… how did you do that? Who cares? I love it! You're my favorite teacher! Just doing my job! I feel amazing! What? Wow! I love your new look! Oh, I have something to give you! Really? For me? Thanks, bestie! Selfie! I love this class. Oh, I need to change. Ahem. So, today's lesson. Hmm, my crush has me feeling inspired. I sure hope he appreciates this. Here goes nothing. Uh, what's up, David? Nice. What she write to me? Yep, I've got some feelings about this. <laughs> Be still, my heart. Let's see here. Gah! My books! Sorry. Let me help you with those. Oh. So soft. Uh-huh. Wow. Um, my books? Oh, right. So… Yeah. Thank you. I think I'm in love. Wait. Just one last look. Yep. This guy is really something. Ah. Uh, oh, that's what I'll say. Nothing like reminding your sweetie about the moment you first laid eyes on each other. The hard part's over. Nice. Wow. I remember! Such a sweetheart! Love you, baby. Prepping for your art project is all part of the process. A messy one at that. Anyway, time to turn this idea into art. First stroke is always the best. Add a little bit of blue here. It's really coming together. Or is it? This is terrible! Nope! Good thing I have lots more paper! Ooh, smooth. This is worse than the first one! Ugh! Come on now, focus! You've gotta be kidding me. Why can't I paint a stupid flower? Alright. Stay calm. Deep breath in. I can do this. I am fully capable. It's go time. Easy. Easy. Shoo! Huh? That was unfortunate. But wait a minute. 
What an interesting shape! I can work with this! Using your paintbrush in different ways can help you create entirely unique designs. And in my case, petals! Once you've gone all the way around, add some green for the leaves and stems. See how it's all coming together? Careful strokes go a long way. You can even attach these two. It fills out the space quite nicely. I knew I could do it! Whoa! You drew all this on your own? Why don't you have it, Annie? I've got more creating to do. And this time, I'm taking a whole new approach. But don't worry, we're still staying on theme here. See how these strokes make the leaves really come alive? Don't be afraid to take your time with these. You can even make grass, see? But the next part gets a little more complicated. I can use some puffy paints like these to create all new fun textures with a balloon! How satisfying was that? Now use it like a stamp. And you'll get these fun, totally unique flowers. Don't forget this one. Cool, right? Awesome! What do you think? <gasps> David! How did you even come up with that? My secret ingredient! Aw, this picture sure is cheery. Good enough to be framed. And why stop there? Just need some inspo. Mm-hmm. Right. You said what? Oh, Susan, you're bad! Ugh, I don't know. Um, excuse me? My paper! Oh, my bad. Oops. Look what you've done! It's ruined! Hey! Can I show you something? Ever hear of a happy accident? This is one of them. Whoa. Me? Yeah! You can do different sizes, too! Amazing! Let's do it! How many do you think can fit on here? As many as you want! Things are getting crazy! You can use pretty much anything. As long as it's circular, of course. You think we've done enough yet? It sure looks cool, doesn't it? A pie! My little artist. Huh? It sure is dark in here. I'm so scared. What is that thing over there? Get out of my room, please! Help! What's going on in here? A big scary monster! You woke me up for this? A coat rack? Oh, I guess it was just in my mind. Good night! Sorry. It sure is dark. Just a coat rack, right? I'll be fine. What? Ah! It's back! I need help! Please, help! What? Over there! Ugh. <laughs> I don't see anything in here. I know how to stop this once and for all. Start by blacking out the entire canvas. Once you've done that, use a stamp brush to put a bit of white down. Then use black to create a tree. The goal is to make a bunch of them. Then use white to make a sky full of stars. Then get a blade and pierce the canvas. Just make a bunch of random holes. Then push little lights through them. This ought to keep you safe. Wow! Now you have nothing to be afraid of. Lights up! Huh? What is that thing? A monster? Oh, okay, stop teasing me already. I feel so much better now. Monster free is the way to be. Okay, guys, it's picnic time. Just eat your pretend food. Ugh, I'm bored. Ooh, sissy's phone. 
Uh, but I can't open the thing. I know. All I need is her face. Easy. Don't wake up. Face, please! I won't work without her eyeballs. This tape seems pretty strong. Just gotta open those lids without her waking up. Can't forget about the other one. Hey, <laughs> there they are. Time to unlock this bad boy once and for all. Anything? Uh, still not working, huh? If only your face looked more natural. Come on, close! What's wrong with that thing? Now stay shut, will ya? Just stop moving! Okay, this definitely isn't working. Wait a minute. I can use this clear piece of paper. Just gonna rest it on her face. And trace over her entire face. The phone recognizes the general shapes of the face, after all. Hey, at least she's staying still. Just gotta get the jawline right. Perfection! A masterpiece! Gah! Can I help you? Why does this look so familiar? <sighs> if you really want to draw a face, use a photo. Off! I'll show you how to do this right. First, you have to assemble your writing utensils. Make something that looks like an H. See? It's ready. Begin tracing the face like so. And the other side will draw the same thing. It just follows the movement. See? It's totally effortless. No fancy art training necessary. Looks pretty accurate, doesn't it? Like looking in the mirror. Hey! It worked! See ya! Whatever you do, don't read my text! Or look through my camera roll! It's a heart this time. You'll need some more supplies. Go for it, girls! Look at all these pens! Wow! That's all I've got. Seriously? <laughs> Good luck. Oh! I have an idea! This will look amazing! I'll draw a giant heart! So far, so good! Now I'll draw a smaller heart inside! It's perfect! That's awful! Hey! Look at my drawing! That's nice. I suppose I better draw something. Hang on. I have an idea! I'll use the pen and the pencil at the same time. Now for the fun part. I'll draw lines across the center of the heart. That should do it. Now I'll add shading. I'll add thicker shading at parts to create shadows. This is going to plan! Now I'll cut it out around the top of the heart. Miss, miss! I finished! <laughs> Sorry. Okay, let's see your art. Ooh, very clever, Molly. I like it. Uh, Sarah? Where is your heart? It's over there! Oh! It's… it's like street art. Different approaches, but both excellent. I love them. Aw, thanks! This looks so cute! Matthew will love it! Oh. Maybe not. I'll need to fix it. Great. I don't have an eraser. It's fine. There'll be one in my pencil case. Where is it? I know I have one. Hold on. Gina! Can I use your eraser, please? Sure. Here you go. Oops. Hey, you. Thanks. I appreciate it. Just what I need. Matthew still has it! I'll go see him. He'll be so surprised. Phew. Matthew lives far away. At least I don't need a shower later. I should've brought a jacket. I can't wait to see him. What? You look so pretty today. I don't believe it! And with my eraser! This is the worst! Stupid Matthew! How could he? I'm 
never gonna give him my eraser again! <gasps> what am I gonna do? Gina! Uh, how long have you been there? Use the sharpener. How? Wait a minute. I've got it! Thanks! I should have thought of this earlier. I'll start by flipping the sharpener over. Then I'll cover the underside of the sharpener with glue. I'll fill it all the way to the top. Now to let it set. That should do it. The glue will erase the pencil. It's working perfectly! Now to finish my drawing. Huh? I thought I could help. And I got you this. Oh, it's so cute! I'm sorry. Who knew science was so interesting? Oh, a message. Oh no! I forgot Gina's birthday! I need to get her a gift! There must be something around here that I can use. That's a start. Now I just need to find a gift. Whoa! Ouch. Hey! I can use that ribbon! That's gonna hurt later. Okay, time to get creative. This is going well. There! It looks amazing! But what can I put in it? A doll? Hmm. Aw, another doll! Just what I need. Nope. Flowers. That's a good idea. They're beautiful! Uh, where did those bees come from? Uh, I got stung! Uh, I can't risk it. Now this is a good idea. Are you kidding me? No way! Ugh. Come on, think! Oh, I know! I can make her a journal! Start with an ordinary notebook. Open the back cover. And start to apply a thin line of glue along the edge. Do this along the side and the bottom of the page. Next, you'll need a length of pink ribbon. Stick the ribbon to the glue. Repeat this with more lengths of pink ribbon along the bottom of the page. Once you've done that, you'll need some green ribbon. Stick the strips of green ribbon along the side of the page. Don't leave any gaps. Keep it side by side. Now close the notebook over. Fold the pink ribbon over the notebook. Then thread the green ribbon over and under the pink ribbon. Continue this all the way up the notebook with each strand of ribbon. You'll create a lattice effect. Open the notebook back up and run a strip of glue along the top of the page. Fold the excess ribbon over the cover and stick it to the glue. Make sure it's pressed down firmly. Apply glue along the edge again, over the top of the ribbons. Remember to only put it on the three edges. Now put a sheet of card over the glue. Give it a press to make sure it's stuck in place. There! A homemade journal! I hope Gina likes it. I'm ready for Gina's birthday! I got you something! Wow! <sighs> Shredded paper! Thanks! Seriously? Look in the box. Oh, right! Thank you! You're the best! I know. Your next challenge is to draw a unicorn. Yes! I love unicorns! That's like a horse, right? I'm awful at drawing animals. Psst. What? Check this out. So much cash! It's yours if you draw my unicorn. Sarah! No! Draw it yourself! It's your loss. I'm gonna fail this round. That seems a little dramatic. I know a good hack for this. I'll place my hand on the paper and draw around it. Now I'll fill it in. It's such an easy way to draw a unicorn. I'll color it in now. Pink is the perfect color for a unicorn. Aw, it's so cute! I'll add more color to the horn. That was so quick! It's all done! Aw, look at it! Why are you so happy? Hmm, this gives me an idea. I can just copy Molly. But I'll make mine a rich unicorn! This makes the perfect horn! Good art costs money. What do you think? Seriously? It's the exact same as mine! Uh, no. Mine costs more. Yoo-hoo, teacher! Oh, look at that. Wonderful. Well done, both of you! I'm an artist! Fine. I'll let you have this one. Oops. Well, 
I guess this is where we are now. So, let's see what's up. Hey, how are you? We haven't talked in forever. <sighs> Might as well work on my manicure, I guess. Huh? Finally! Something's happening! Look at that light! Something alien and UFO-y is going on. Exciting! This is so cool. I can't wait to see what happens next. Wait, I got stuck with no hands? Come on, that's not fair. I got one hand, and I'm totally okay with that. Time to start drawing my little alien guy. There's his head. Now to work on his body. Can't be a little alien dude without any arms. Two, of course. And then down to his little sticky legs. Now to add some details. He needs to have his typical big black eyes. And a little nose and mouth, too. Now to get him up and moving. Ugh, she totally makes it look so easy with her one hand she can use. Oh my gosh, it's an actual alien right here next to me! He's doing something with my plate and a marker. Hmm, let's see what he did. Looks like he tried to draw an alien. Hey, Mr. Alien Dude! Check out what I did on my plate! See? I can make him dance when the water moves. Man, he's got some great moves if I say so myself. Do you love it? I bet you totally love it. Yes! He loves it! Whoa! Look at that amazing space cake! Wow! He's putting it by me! I guess I get it! Here, you can have this! This might be the best cake I've ever seen! Uh -huh. She gets a cake and I get what? Nothing, I guess. Other than just this alien scribble on my plate. Hey! What about my plate? Don't you want this one too? Maybe in exchange for a cake? No? What the heck? You're the one who drew it! I can't believe this. Mmm. This looks great. I'm going in for a bite. How? Oh, mmm. That is one delicious space cake. I'm definitely glad that I won this one. These candies are my favorite. So fruity. The tropical flavors are definitely the better ones, I think. Wait a second. I have an idea. Let me pour some of these out of the bag. They're so colorful and pretty, too. I really love the pink. And now for some organization. I'll start with these blue ones. And here comes the pink. All right! They're all organized and ready for some magic! Yes! It worked! It turned into a poppet just like I hoped it would! Time for me to get poppin'. Hey! What the heck? And what are you doing? We're supposed to be doing art. Oh, right. I forgot. Just got distracted by the poppet, I guess. Yes! I get to use hands this time! And both of them, too! <laughs> Now's my chance. Don't mind if I play with this a bit. Actually, I'm gonna use it for my artwork. I'll start with this paint. Okay, I'll just paint the insides of the poppet with this brush. I'm very excited to see how this turns out in the end. All right, now to do the same with the orange row of the poppet. Okay, that's done. Now let's give this a try. I'll have to flip over this poppet onto my paper. Now to start popping. Red, red, maybe this blue over here. Man, look at her using both hands like she's allowed to do. Wait, I know what I'm gonna do. Come on, nose. You're gonna function as my paintbrush. Ooh, the paint is kinda chilly. Time to add some dots of paint to my paper with my nose. This is going well. Time to switch colors. Look! I made my poppet shapes with my nose! Yay! I made mine, too. It's pretty great, not gonna lie. Look at how perfect my dots are. Definitely better than yours. Whoa! The magic's back! Poppet cookies! Don't mind if I do. Oh. Mmm. Oh, wow. This is so, so tasty. It definitely looks pretty good. I'm gonna take a bite, too. Whoa! Are you seeing this light right here? Ooh, looks like we've got boxes this time. I'm gonna take this one. No way! Look what was in mine! Cans of spray paint! I wonder what's in mine? I can't tell just by shaking. I'll open it. Wow! It's a whole box full of new colored pencils! I love them! Oh! Look! Another little box! What do you think's inside? I'll open it and find out. Huh. That's not what I expected. It's a gummy eyeball. So squishy. Okay, I'm gonna eat it because I'm hungry. Mmm, that's very tasty. And chewy. I love it. Wow, that was a really good snack. I wish I had even more to eat. Hey, look! We both get to use hands this time! All right, I've got my gloves and I'm ready to make some art. I'm gonna start with this blue color and make a splotch in the middle. Now I'll use this glass as a guide for the white paint. There. Now we've got a perfect blue circle. Next up, I need this plate. I'll put it face down on the paper. Time to break out the black spray paint now. Okay, I need a little black in the middle for a pupil, because it's an eye. I'm ready with my pencils and my one hand. Here I go! Time to draw an eye with my single hand. This is going pretty good so far. And I think I'm done! Ta-da! My happy little face is done! Whoa! How the heck did you do that? 
What? My cute little eye? Didn't it turn out fantastic? No way! The magic turned my picture into another gummy eyeball! Except it's a huge one! No way! What the heck? That's gigantic! Can I have it? Uh, no way. This belongs to me. Now excuse me. I need to eat my giant eyeball. <sighs> Man. Though I guess I didn't give her any of my cake. <laughs> Whoa! What's going on? What is this? Oh, another one? They keep coming! My nails look amazing! Hmm, getting the right skill is tricky. But it's fun. Yeah, sure. What is that? It's my ship. Whatever. Let me focus on my nails. That's fine. I need to finish this. Oh no! My pencil! And I don't have a sharpener. Oh, what'll I do now? What's wrong? My pencil snapped and I can't sharpen it. Uh, take this! Oh, okay. How does that feel? No! Use it on your pencil! Oh, right. I see. I'll run the pencil over the nail file. It's working! Look! Now I can finish my drawing! I told you! I have an idea. I'll draw you! Wait, I've been working on some poses. How's that? Ugh, awful. Oh, I know! Go over there! Okay. Ready? That's more like it. I feel so glamorous. Put your hand on your head. Like this? That's it. Wonderful. How much longer? Hey! Ugh. I'm awake! What do you think? Uh, yeah. Good effort. This is my best work yet. Wow, that's really stuck up there. That looks chewy. Uh-oh! Hi. Take a seat, Ellie. Oh, okay. Don't look at me. She seems friendly. This color suits me. Uh, achoo! Okay, class. Open up your books. Do I have to? We have a very exciting lesson today. Yeah, right. I love her notebooks! I suppose I better take some notes. I know. My pen is super cute. I wish I had nice things. All my things are so boring. <laughs> it's not fair. What's going on back there? Hold on. What's the problem? I have pen envy. Let me see that. That's one fancy pen. Maybe I can help. Really? Upgrade your pens with this simple trick. Remove the parts from the pen. Then fill the casing with glue. Try not to make a mess at this stage. That should do it. Now pour in some glitter. Put the ink back into the casing. And screw on the nib. No more boring pens. Looks good, huh? Wow! Look at that! I can't forget about this cute little guy. Oh, he's so adorable. Thanks! Hmm. Wait there. Now I feel more comfortable. Wow! You're so stylish! I'll take those. These won't do. You need a makeover. I feel so alive! How… how did you do that? Who cares? I love it! You're my favorite teacher! Just doing my job! I feel amazing! What? Wow! I love your new look! Oh, I have something to give you! Really? For me? Thanks! Bestie! 
I love this class. Oh, I need to change. Ahem. So, today's lesson. 